ESPN Radio Network. Hi folks, Alex Jones here with some important information. I want to tell you about Matt Redhawk and his team of patriots over at My Patriot Supply. Several years ago, Matt was sitting in his two-bedroom apartment, frustrated with the direction this country was headed, and the charlatans willing to sell us out for a quick buck. Deciding to take action, a company run by Patriots for Patriots was born. My Patriot Supply has never taken a loan or accepted outside funding. They now operate two distribution facilities and employ over 50 hardworking American men and women. It is rare to find companies who practice what they preach. And that's why I stock my pantry with high-quality storable foods from My Patriot Supply. Go to MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex today for special offers on emergency food storage or call their preparedness specialist at 866-229-0927. That's 866-229-0927. Do business with someone who shares your values. MyPatriotSupply.com slash Alex. Dude, what do you think about the FBI saying that there's a terror alert on Monday about a potential Fort Hood situation? The police are shoving people, shoving Alex, shoving the crowd. Here we go, folks. I'm being assaulted. Whether it's the radio show, the news websites, documentary films, or the nightly news, InfoWars is the tip of the spear. Is this another false flag stage attack to take our civil liberties and put more homeland security by sticking their hands down on the pants on the streets? It's up to us to set brush fires in the minds of men and women everywhere. And that's what PrisonPlanet.tv is doing designed to do. You watch, the Assad regime is going to be blamed or accused of using chemical weapons against the so-called rebels. What we see now is a war against reality. It's a war against the truth. It's more vital than ever that supporters of freedom become members of PrisonPlanet.tv and share their membership with up to 11 friends and family. Visit InfoWarsNews.com today. Become a member, share your membership, and help take the InfoWar to the next level. Globalist social engineers are not just targeting us with propaganda. They are manipulating our genetics. We are being targeted at every level by estrogen mimickers that lower our testosterone and other hormones and natural compounds that the body needs. After consulting top doctors, nutritionists, pharmacists, and others, we have developed what I believe is the ultimate non-GMO organic super male vitality formula sourced from powerful organic herbs and then concentrated for maximum Potency. Super Male Vitality was developed to activate your body's own natural processes instead of using synthetic chemicals. Super Male Vitality by InfoWars Life is so powerful that I only take half the recommended dose. For a limited time, we are offering 15% off Super Male Vitality at InfoWarsLife.com to introduce you to this powerful supplement. Visit InfoWarsLife.com today to secure your Super Male Vitality. InfoWarsLife.com. We are in process of developing a whole series of techniques which uh, will enable the controlling oligarchy to get people actually to love their servitude. Uh, people can be made to enjoy a state of affairs which by any decent standard they ought not to enjoy. Perhaps you had better start from the beginning. <laughs> Perhaps you had better start from the beginning. Perhaps you had better start from the beginning. Too many kids are what's making the planet worse. A lot of these kids come from bad gene pools. They don't have stable parents making good decisions. Mercury containing vaccines may help not harm kids, according to two new studies in the journal Pediatrics. These new studies suggest that the opposite, that the preservatives may actually be associated with improved behavior and mental performance. Fluoride in water is supposed to fight tooth decay, but could it also cause cancer? Turns out the government had the right under U.S. law to conduct secret testing on the American public under specific conditions. We have to work the dark side, but we want to spend time in the shadows. Any attempt to achieve world order must be the work of the devil. Well, join me. I'm, I'm glad to sit here at the right hand of Satan. There's a need for a new world order. Someday, in the next few years, a solution will emerge.
We all go down the new world order black hole of tyranny. Monday through Friday, 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. Central. You like tyranny, ladies and gentlemen. You've got front row seats. Crank it up. It's good coffee right there. Pure Americana from Southern Mexico. That's Americana. My favorite organic coffee. We bring it to you from InfoWarsStore.com. It helps fund the operation. I've got happy that little fish on my coffee got fish as well. All right, getting serious here, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to mentally regroup and finish up with what's uh, happening in Ukraine. Then I'm going to get into the incredibly insane news. It's the company and the, and the Republican congressman promoting it going, yes, we've created a database and the state signed on to it where we watch everything every citizen does and we make sure that you're loyal to the state and not a threat. Uh, the video is up on InfoWars.com. It's a slow video, but it really builds up. Uh, I'm, I'm debating whether I should play it or not on air. New York Homeland Security encourages businesses to snitch on preppers as terrorists. We have video of that. Homeland Security to purchase 25 million more shotgun rounds. Yeah, more in the geopolitical news. China challenges Obama's Asia pivot with rapid military buildup. Mainstream media reports on criminal interest in the U.S. arming Al-Qaeda with missiles. That's in the Daily Mail. And we've got TSA agents groping two- and six-year-old children, even though they claim they've stopped that. And speaking of that, uh, Brian Singer, sex abuser, names three more Hollywood bigwigs in lawsuits. We've got a special report coming up on that. There's no doubt Hollywood is absolutely filled with sexual abusers of men, women, children, you name it. I, I, I have been contacted over the years by some of the people that are now going public. And I'll just leave it at that. And I don't have the lawyers or the time to prove what they're saying. And so I passed on breaking all this. Not with this particular guy, but with some of the other people. I'll just say this. Some of the names listed in the John Bounds report that's coming up are people that have contacted us. And reportedly, uh, they've been killing people that report on this. Uh, and that's not why I haven't reported on it. It's just that I can prove that the government's buying 2.6 billion rounds of ammo and thousands of armored vehicles, but the media says I'm lying. I can prove under the Emergency Centers Establishment Act they built FEMA camps. But the media says I'm lying, even though it's documented. I can prove that they ordered a stand down at Benghazi, but the media says that didn't happen. Uh, I can prove that there's a $5,000 fine per employee that you have in 2014 if you don't get insurance for your employees or lay them off or cut their hours. But the media says that's not true, even though it's happening and in the bill. I can prove there's death panels. They say they don't exist. Um, I can prove under the Night Stalkers, Fort Campbell, Kentucky, and other secret FEMA programs, there are black helicopters that are radar resistant with a special paint. Uh, that's been declassified for 20 years, but the media says it doesn't exist. So real stuff we can prove people aren't ready for. So I'm just going to be honest with you. This is one of the things that, I mean, I remember, I remember it's got to be 10 years ago, um, David Icke on the show saying, I know BBC presenters that rape children and their dead bodies, and I know a member of uh, Parliament who became Prime Minister who slits children's throats when this person delivers them, and this person hangs out with the royal family and brings them children. And David was about to say their name on air. He told me off air, and later on his own website said Savelle, Jimmy Savelle. And I'm like, people heard these interviews. These interviews are online. I'm like, uh-uh, no names, no, no. Because, I mean, it just sounds insane all turned out to be true. I mean, he said Jimmy Savelle, 10 years ago, by name, was having sex with kids, delivering them to the royal family, slitting their throats, on and on and on. Uh, and now uh, most of that has come out. So I don't even know what to say anymore. Um, I have trouble wrapping my mind around all this. So that's coming up as well. 
And we've got uh, Pentagon plans uh, to replace flight crews with full-time robots. That's a headline out of the Washington Times. Uh, DARPA said back in 2000 that by 2020, there will be no combat aircraft in the Air Force. The, 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 the Army and Marine Corps will still have some ground attack aircraft that are human piloted, but that'll be vestigial. There will be no combat aircraft with humans flying them. And the drones will be autonomous. It'll be no more medals for the drone pilots. And so there's that article. And I got another one here. Uh, Pentagon scientist shows off life-size robot uh, with, with the sec def Chuck Hagel firsthand look at the Terminator style uh, robot. That's a quote from the Pentagon. Terminator style. And again, that robot you're looking at is at least a 20-year-old design, just for all the boys and girls out there. I was brought up speed on these robots in 1999 by a Marine Corps officer. And then later I was able to verify through open intelligence that what he told me was uh, accurate. And a lot of this is psyops, ladies and gentlemen. They actually have robots that look like Terminator. More like the one that you see in the, in the, in the last one where it's a more primitive one marching down the street, and they even have skull heads to terrify the public. In fact, this one being rolled out has more of a menacing face, but they're going to phase in for the public now the skull faces and the rest of it just to purely terrorize you and your family. Uh, Japan's already deploying six years ago robots on the streets. Now New York has announced they're deploying robots, little, little robots that look like... Uh, What's the Doctor Who things that say exterminate, exterminate? Uh, the Daleks. They look like Daleks. That was in the news last week with their domes. And they tattle on you and report on you and shout orders at you. That's just preparing you with something non-threatening till they put, well, robots that look just like the combat robots they have in um, the latest uh, RoboCop. In fact, that's exactly what these big combat robots look like uh, is the robots out of RoboCop. So we're going to be getting into that for you. And again, they don't need you anymore. As soon as the robots are brought online, you're not needed anymore. And as soon as they have robots working on robots, which a bunch of companies already have, uh, it's, it's game over. Because you're seen as an infestation on the earth. You've been taught you're an ugly infestation. So most people now want to die and believe it's good. And have been taught how wonderful it's going to be when the humans are wiped out. So you've been given a subconscious and conscious preparation for all this for you and your family. Okay, so I said I wanted to get back into Ukraine. I'll do that here in just a moment. First off, uh, ladies and gentlemen, please don't forget that this entire broadcast is brought to you by our great sponsors like MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex to find their specials. MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex. Everyone should have storable food. Everyone should be prepared. My Patriot Supply refuses to sell to Homeland Security and they keep their obviously customer list secret. But who cares if the criminal feds know you have storable food? Everyone's to store food and say, hey, criminals. I know you want to starve us out like the Ukrainians, like the Russians did, or the, or the uh, Polish were starved. You know, go to Hades. We're going to have guns and food, and we're not afraid of you. But MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex. Great customer service. Or give them a call, 866-229-0927. Now, it's also important, we mainly fund ourselves by selling incredibly high-quality products at InfoWarsLife.com the Survival Shield nascent iodine that has just done wonders for myself and my family. No other iodine had the same effect. Uh, it is, is the purest form, turns blue on paper, not black. It is the, in the crystalline form. It just goes directly into your bloodstream and just has done amazing things. Everything Dr. Group said and more, this is a proprietary type Survival Shield, half the cost, Double the strength of the leading competitor. We have Silver Bullet, the InfoWarsLife.com brand of super-powered uh, colloidal silver. Nature's antibiotic. Uh, we've got the Super Mel Vitality, still 15% off, but I'm going to be getting rid of that soon. That simply energizes you, allows your glands to produce the hormones they need. It doesn't mimic hormones. Everyone that takes it says it either is life-changing and their libido and energy and weightlifting, or they bare minimum say, I have a ton of more energy now and really feel like working out more. I mean, bottom line, it, 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 